You know, we often tell students to dream big when it comes to their talents. Now, one local school is helping those dreams come true with a state-of-the-art recording studio. It's a great example of what's right with our schools. This may look like a jam session in Los Angeles or Nashville. But these are students and teachers in Guilford County. This state-of-the-art recording studio provided to Penn Griffin School of the Arts through a partnership with Notes for Notes. There's nothing really quite like this. This is really a first of its kind recording studio inside of a public school. One more, maybe? We are the best school in this town, because when we show up, we don't mess around. There you go. Max Miller is the Notes for Notes studio manager. He was instrumental in transforming the dream into a reality. Penn Griffin already has history as a school, being John Coltrane's alma mater. Uh, I think it's a really great community to put something like this in because it provides access to a lot of students here in the arts community and can really change the trajectory of a lot of kids' lives here. That's already happening. Music production teacher Jordan Lee sees his students growing every day. I have watched this process transform the students. Watching them get involved inside of the studio space has just brought a level of like compassion and confidence and inside of them to really want to do more and show up to school. I think that's been the, the really exciting part about it. They, they yearn to be here. And I think that's a really powerful thing as we're looking for how to get students to be excited about being somewhere that they can learn. It's also transforming the norms of education. What I love about the studio is we can redefine what it looks like to take a seat, to take a test, to, to experience a quiz. And like, we don't, we don't necessarily use those words and maybe we use them as transfer points for the students. But, you know, when we say, hey, you got a quiz, they're like, okay, what's the pressure project we're creating? You know, they, they look at it in the lens of creation and are excited about walking into what we would all be nervous about when you hear exam or any kind of uh, evaluation. So it's, it's pretty cool watching that mental transformation for how they approach school. There's so much that you can do in a space like this. It's not just a recording studio, really. We try to touch on every aspect of the music industry, from recording and engineering to also being lyricist, how to release your music, music history, business, we do events, we do music videos, we do short films even. The studios are also open to other schools, like this teacher from Union Hill Elementary, who's composing a new school song. She was impressed with how professional the students were. They asked me some wonderful questions yesterday. They were asking me about tempo, the key that I had it in. They were asking um, if I wanted to sing it all the way through or do chunks. I mean, very, very thoughtful questions to help along with this process. So they are going to be some great recording engineers at, at one day. And just like the great John Coltrane, they'll be able to say they got their start at Penn Griffin. Well, both Miller and Lee say the possibilities are endless when it comes to the Notes for Notes studio. They admit they've only scratched the surface with what can be created there.